Hello and welcome to another update video here about Ethereum. So Ethereum, it seems like that pump that we currently see across the market might have originated from Ethereum. Um, Bitcoin already shows a bit of weakness. Um, Ethereum, not yet at least. Um, we don't see a lot of volume, I have to say. Yeah, uh, there's a little bit of an increase in volume, but not a lot. So I'm not sure if that is a long lasting move here. But we broke out of the triangle, so it's noteworthy. Um, something I made you aware of in the earlier video, also posted it on the Telegram Signals channel for gold members earlier, that there is a potential for a breakout here. And watch the chart. Um, a breakout expected based on traditional TA here to the upside, a bullish pennant. Based on the Elliott waves, I would have liked to see a wave Y to the downside. It wasn't absolutely necessary. Um, and it's still possible, by the way, in a fake out scenario, we could still come into this area here. That would, in my opinion, be the ideal level for a wave Y. Um, and would also be in line with the measurement of the uh, height of the triangle to the downside. However, if we go up, that would be sort of um, in line with the higher level trend anyway. And overall, we are expecting higher prices for Ethereum, as I mentioned. Um, but the scenario of a dip here into this green area and then a reversal to the upside was and still is on the table, obviously getting less likely now that we broke out of the triangle. But as long as we are below 1784, uh, still on the table, because it could only be a fake out. Now a we'll move above 1784, which is the wave one high here, would take a certainly higher and we could get really to $2,000, I think is the first major resistance level because it is a psychological one. It is also here the wave C high from before. So basically resistance level, but really a major level only because of psychological, um, you know, it, it's sort of, a, it's a relevant level, you know, every $1,000 level is, is sort of relevant from a psychological point of view. Um, but really in that third wave that we might be building here, we should see higher prices if we um, just take a look at ideal extension level. So around about the $2,300 dollar level here. Uh, first would be 2080. That is the one to one ratio between wave one and wave three. That would be the, the first target. And the next one would be 2340 for this wave three. So that'll, that'll be interesting. You know, um, the volatility might be starting now. I said it before in the Bitcoin video, expect volatility towards the weekly candle close, the monthly candle close, all of that quite relevant. Where are we actually? So this should give you all that you need yeah, to figure out where we're going. Uh, in a fake out scenario, we will drop here into this region between 1520 and 1620, in my opinion, because if you see a fake out, then it often goes the other way, you know, it, it off because it shows the weakness in the chart. Weekly candle will probably close in the green. Yeah, and then we've had our four green candles in a row, which is bullish monthly nice and green probably not going to be a bullish engulfing one that would be nice if we would end it if we ended above two thousand dollars today which i don't think is going to happen but that would be bullish to see a bullish engulfing one here would be quite powerful but yeah so um that's currently here my view about ethereum so hopefully you like the update if you did please hit the like button leave a comment and subscribe and if you really like the content then please check out the channel membership thanks a lot for watching bye bye